Hey guys, it's Kaler. Welcome to the YouTube channel. In today's video, I have an Adobe XD parallax effect for you guys. This is going to be a very quick video. It's just going to be showing you the effect so you can apply it into your own designs. If you're interested in downloading my example, the link will be down in the description for the completed project. So let's get started. So first up, I have an artboard that's completely finished except the image slots. So I have these two rectangles in a group called cards. I have a overlay, which is just this recommended, and I have card one and card two, which are just basic rectangles. So with card one selected, I'm gonna drag in an image and that's gonna automatically mask it. I'm gonna select the second image and just drag in another one. So now my app is finished and I want to apply my parallax effect. So I'm gonna select the artboard and hit command D to make a duplicate. Let's name this one O2. You can also just drag this one over a little bit to make some space. The first thing I need to do is turn on my grid, click on the grouping, hold shift and drag over until it touches the margin. Then we can uncheck the grid. So now we have both states for our drag effect. So let's go ahead and link that up. So I'm gonna select the cards grouping and drag this over. Make sure the trigger is set to drag and the action is auto animate. And we'll repeat that back to the first screen. Adobe XD remembers all the settings. So now if we hit the desktop preview, you'll see that when we drag, we have that nice drag effect. So let's switch over to the design tab and make the parallax effect. First thing I'm gonna do is select the card one and double click until I get inside of the mask. I'm gonna select the image and just drag it over just slightly. I'm gonna do the same thing for card two on the first artboard. Just drag it over just a little bit. So now if we hit our desktop preview, if I drag over, you'll see the parallax effect is actually taking place. So that's it for today's video. If you found this tip helpful, consider giving it a thumbs up. Subscribe for more design and code related content. I now upload every Tuesday and Thursday, so make sure you have that notification bell on so you don't miss a video. And as always, have a great day, and I'll see you guys in the next one.